Jardine exclusive. Keep watching. Welcome back to Bougie Fragrance. I'm Dawn and Photography Guy. What's up? <laughs> he's delayed a little. Yeah, a little Usually delayed. he's on point or he's ahead of the game, but today we'll just photography guy. Get on your game. I will. Good I'm job. I'm sorry. You're usually on your game. Yep. My mind was preoccupied. So like I was saying, you're here each and every time we record and upload a new video on Sundays and Thursdays. Sundays and Thursdays. Photography guy. Yeah. What did we find? What did we find? The Jardine exclusive. Yes, we did. And, and, and it's good. Yes, it is good. It's so very we're going to talk about this. So the box, I ended up getting a 60 ml. I thought I was ordering a 120 ml bottle. I thought well, the price is pretty good for some reason and I couldn't figure out why. And I, you know, I was just pushing buttons, she order, was. order, order. She likes order. to do that. It was, they were Mancera's, so I'm in. Shut up, photography guy. Okay. <laughs> and so I pushed the button. I ordered this. It came in. I'm like, oh, that box is pretty small for 60 some dollars. But for 60 some dollars, I got a killer fragrance. So Jardin Exclusive or Jardin Exclusive. It depends on where you're from and how you talk. But I'm in Florida. So right now it's Jardin Exclusive. Right? Yeah. Photography guy? Yeah. Okay, but we can give it a kick and call it Jardin Exclusive. There you go. Or Jardin exclusive. I'm, I'm, I'm right here. <laughs> so this came out in 2018 and the house of Mancera is who makes this product? My gosh. Mancera. You guys know that we love Mancera's photography guy. Yes, we do. We yes, do. You we just do. got your second bottle of red tobacco. Yes. Super excited. You haven't tapped it yet though, no, have no. you? No, no. I you're, will. You're holding out. Yeah. But you've been wearing that Tom Ford's um, Brave Love, no, White Suede. White Suede. That's what you've been yes. picking up right now. A couple days in a row you've been wearing yeah. it. And I'm yep. glad because it was full. Yeah, God, it need, you, needed to be used. It needed some love, didn't yeah, it? It, needed, it some needed some love. So let's talk about this. The main accords of this, and I have, I have my notes because I can't remember this. This is fruity, it's powdery, it's sweet, it's musky, it's citrus, it's fresh, it's white floral, vanilla, animalic, and caramel. I can't, all of that in one fragrance. Oh, I know. It is so good. So, so good. The top notes are pear, white peach, caramel, lemon, black currant, Sicilian orange, and green apple. The middle notes are jamber, jasmine, ambergris, violet, bug, and Bulgarian rose. The base notes are white musk, Madagascar vanilla, and sandalwood. I think this reminds a lot of people of Kirk by Tiziana Terenzi. I know, I know. So I put this on and I put Kirk on. I'm like, I get the similarities. I get it. So if you have and you love Kirk by Tiziana Terenzi, you're probably going to be okay with loving this as well. This is faceted towards, pushed towards a mutual sex fragrance. Like, what am I trying to say? Photography. Men and women can wear this. Yeah, men, unisex. Uni, thank you. Mu mutual. Unisex. Mutual sex. Yes, mutual. Mutual sex. <laughs> unisex fragrance. That's exactly what this is. It is good. Some people think this smells like a, an amazing fruity shampoo. I try not to go to watch reviews, but couldn't help it because I didn't know how to pronounce the, the fragrance. So I ended up getting stuck in that rabbit hole of anybody that reviewed this fragrance. And I've seen all your videos and they're great. And it gave me amazing insight. But some people do think that this, this smells like a really nice fruity shampoo. If you're into a fruity fragrance, but again, it's powerful. It is strong. This is a very, very strong fragrance. It's not a safe blind buy. Not a, I, I definitely suggest you get a sample somewhere. You smell it first before you purchase it. I think it's more for the spring, early spring, springtime into May. Uh, yeah, early summer. Early summer into early summer. If you're a seasonal fragrance wear type person, this is a also compliment getter. This is a compliment getter. Let's sit down. Do we love this photography guy? Yeah, absolutely. Gosh. We do love this. I'm going to, I guarantee this is going to be a, a repurchase when this is empty. Guarantee it because this is that good and I wear it a lot. I really do. I've had it, 
few short days, maybe even a week, and I've already tapped into it quite well, I feel. Um, so I'm going to put this down and we're going to talk about ambergris. ambergris. Before in previous videos, I was saying it's called ambergris. I have done extensive research about am ambergris. I sat down and I had a day off of work and I said, I'm going to learn about a note. I'm going to learn everything I need to know about ambergris. So ambergris is actually a <laughs> an excrement from the intestines of a sperm whale. So scientists really don't know. It's not poo okay it's not poo but it comes scientists don't know if they actually um vomit or they poo out this excrement but it, it, it actually does come from the intestines it's not poo but they might think it comes out the same area yes. the same zone if you know what i mean okay the butt okay <laughs> let's just go with that okay so so it does and and what it's made out of it is made out of um those Things that they eat. Photographic guy, what do they Krill. eat? What? Krill plankton. No, 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 no. They eat, the, they have beaks. Squid. They're made mm -hmm. out of squid beaks and this fatty, blubbery substance and it binds it together. Okay? And so when they excrete it, whether it's between, whether it's vomiting or out, out, the, out of the butt, then it's going to float on top of the water and the salt and the ocean's gonna carry it for years sometimes. Years and years and years. And it's gonna create this waxy substance. It's gonna make it look like this little wax ball of white or brown or black poo substance. And it's gonna wash up on the beach. And people are gonna collect that. And so you can tell if it's real ambergris by if you're walking on the beach, just happen to be walking on the beach and you happen to have a, let's say, something a little metal object maybe a uh, not a clothes pin a bobby pin a pin a pin anything that you can heat up a piece of metal this small piece of metal you can heat up and you put that on that ambergris and it melts right through it dude you got you got some money dude because ambergris per gram can weigh no can sell for up to 30 times more than silver wow silver silver so can you imagine if you find a little ball of ambergris and you sell it, which don't do in the United States, do not, do not, do not buy, collect, or sell ambergris in the United States. It's illegal. You'll get in trouble. So if you have it, you're not supposed to collect it either. So if you find it on the beach in the United States, you can't collect it. I wonder what you do do with it. But what I do know is you don't sell byproducts or products of any kind of an endangered species and sperm whale is one of those endangered species today more fragrance companies in france use the actual ambergris in a fragrance and usually it's on a base note so that's what makes the base note of the fragrance and also ambergris it smells musky it smells animalic and it smells kind of ambery Okay, so what they what the ambergris is used for in a fragrance is to make that hold that fragrance longer onto this onto the person's skin that's wearing it. So it's going to make your fragrance last longer. Oh, I can yeah. That's so good that's one. why it's highly sought after. So if you're in France or if you're ordering a fragrance from France, you're in the United States, and it has ambergris in it, and your bottle costs five hundred bucks uh, and up, U.S. dollars and up. The ambergris in it might be real whale intestine poop vomit slash vomit, <laughs> but that's okay. It's going to make that fragrance last longer, and really, it's okay. I don't mind. I don't think the sperm whale needed it. I don't think anybody died from it. I don't have a problem. But nowadays, nowadays, the ambergris is created in a lab. It's, it's in, in lab. They, it's simulated. So that's how they're able to still put ambergris in more affordable fragrance. You go and you're going to see a designer fragrance and it's, oh my gosh, you're seeing it on the shelf. It's $72.99. Pick it up. It's got ambergris in it. Probably synthetic ambergris. But if you go and you order a fragrance from France and it's got ambergris in it and you're paying six, $700 a bottle, the ambergris is probably, it's possibly, possibly real. And so it's still going to serve the same purpose. It's going to make your fragrance last longer. So I hope you learned something because I had so much fun researching actual ambergris and what it, where it came from and what it's about. And 
the scientists really don't know where it comes from. They know what it is, but they really don't know. There's no one percent of sperm whales. One percent produces this product too. So it's rare. It is really rare. So if you find the ambergris, ambergris on the beach, you call me. We'll talk. Can I ask a question? I can't sell it. Yes. Whoever thought of using it in a perfume? Well, and see, and that's what they said when they pick them up. Some of them smell differently. One ball of ambergris, if you smell it, it might smell like tobacco. One ball of ambergris or clump of ambergris when you pick it up, it might smell animalic. One ball of ambergris, you pick it up, it might just smell like poop. Huh? It's wow. hard to say, okay. but they still keep using it. Did I answer your question? Yeah, very good. I was curious. I was. Okay. I was good, curious. good. I think I did enough research. Did I leave you asking, thinking of any questions about it? Uh, you're, we're good? Yeah. You know what ambergris is? Yeah. And that it's not ambergris, and that's what I was calling it previously, so I'm an idiot. But I also now, by doing my research, prove myself that I don't have to be an idiot about ambergris. It's ambergris, and it is actual whale poop slash vomit, <laughs> and it is worth a lot of money. We can't buy a seller. Collect it in the United States. Don't do that. Ice carrots. That's where I found the most amazing treasures. I wanted to start a stackable bangle collection, so I did. I ordered from icecarrots.com. Use the code bougie to save 15% off your purchase. Some of the best gold prices. They have the best customer service. They have 100% 30-day money-back guarantee. They also have 100% price match guarantee. Free lifetime warranty, free gift packaging. Did I say the best customer service? So go to icecarrots.com today and don't forget to use the code bougie to save yourself 15% off of your treasures. Oh, or my treasures. Have fun. So photographic guy, what are you wearing? Uh, man, Sarah's uh, black gold. Oh. Okay, I can't help it every now and then. I got to break into that one too. Oh, photography guy. Yeah, see? See? <laughs> see? I'm going to have to hide the Manceras in the lockbox, <laughs> aren't I? What, what was that evil laugh? Nothing. That was just an evil laugh. Because you love I'm it that much. Move over to Tom Ford Let's try to do it this way. That's, that's a little bit more yeah, there of you an go. idea of how much it's left is in this bottle. bottle. You're getting down to about half a bottle, yeah. photography guy. So that's another one that you've been. Loving. Yes, yes. That's good to yeah. know. Yeah, very nice. This is good. This is classy clean to me. What do you think? What's that? How, how, what, is this, what vibe do you get when you put this on? <sighs> do you want to try? Do you put it on? Yes. Let me, because you've never really thought about it. You're just no, like, oh, yeah, I, I never smell did. good. I never thought about it. You're just like, oh, I smell good. But what kind of vibe do you get? <sighs> See, it's three squirts on one spot. This is. <laughs> well, this I already had it on. Yeah. It's Mancera photography guy. It is I mean, he said, I thought I was the juice sucker. No, I no. am so proud of him <laughs> for being the biggest juice sucker in the in 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 the home. I just, it's him. Yes. So, photography guy, what kind of vibe do you get? What kind of what? Are you are you are you smelling spicy? Are you smelling clean? Are you no, smelling? No, it's a spicy. It's spicy. Yes, yes, I get a spicy vibe, uh, like a gosh. It's, it's, is it luxurious and rich, or is it more like I'm just going to put it on, go walk on the beach, and relax and have the relaxing vibe? Is it? That's it, it's the nice relaxing. It's, it's yeah. not the yeah, oh my yeah, god, yeah, I'm going to wear this see, to the really office thought, in a suit. Yeah, yeah I never but really thought not? about it. Yeah. Why not? So it's the relaxing, beachy vibe, but yeah. it's spicy. Yeah. Gives you a little bit of edge and yeah. fun vibe. Yeah. That's, I've never, I'm going to have to look it up because I don't know what it does for me because right now I can't smell anything. Oh, yeah. Yes, I can. That is like Irish spring on steroids to me. <laughs> it is a little spicy. I don't get an Irish spring thing. You don't? No. Hmm. I like this. But it, but it has Did a we spicy. review this one yet? I think we have. Well, if not, we will. I'll have to look it up. And I chose to wear Tom Ford's Flor de Portofino Aqua. We're both bright and summery today in yes. December. Photograph. It's snow. It should be snowing behind me. Yeah. With that Christmas because yes. it's holidays. holidays. We had a Christmas party at work, a holiday Christmas party. And I'm in ph pharmaceuticals, so I got this brilliant idea. 
I don't know that it was brilliant, but I got this it idea. Was, it was a really good idea. <laughs> I got this idea to, we're, we're in a pharmacy, mind you. We have a, we work in a large pharmacy. So I purchased 203 ml syringes that don't have the, the needles on them. They're just lure lock syringes. And we filled them with all different flavors of vodka and some rum chata and some J Daniels, yeah, Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels, and we took those in and put them on bowls of ice, and everybody, I mean, there's just syringes everywhere, and it, it was it was a good time, and everybody's like, oh, it's a pharmacy. I'm like, yeah, it's a pharmacy. We have syringes, so we, we got creative. We had a good time, and it was a lot of fun, and a lot of people couldn't walk very well, <laughs> I, and a lot of people did request that next year we don't use the three ml syringes. We use ten ml syringes. <laughs> they want bigger syringes, so we're going to accommodate them next year. Yes, so next year, it'll next be, party. It'll be fun. Learn from our mistakes. That's what we do as humans. We learn. So next year, larger syringes at the Christmas party with vodka. There you go. Right. So on that note, photographic guide. Yeah. This was so much fun. It was. You're an exclusive. We love it. Yes, yes, yes. Not a safe blind buy. Smell it first because it's strong. But but if you like what we like, you're in. You'll love it. On that note, never leave your house naked. Always rock your day with a fragrance. Why did I sing that? Mm -hmm. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Ring that bell. Ding, ding, ding. Sorry. <laughs> what was that? I was, my mind was somewhere else. I'm sorry. To be notified <laughs> of each and every time we record and upload a new video on... Sundays and Thursdays. Sundays and Thursdays. Merry Christmas. It's so super close to the holidays. They're going to be over soon. You all hang in there. They're going to be over soon. I yeah. swear. They're so close to being over. It's going to be amazing. To my family, my sisters, I've been talking to you girls a lot because I miss you girls so much. And I miss you. I miss my sisters. Okay, I love you. And I love you guys too. And I love everybody. Right? Photography right. guy. Yep. And so do you. Yes, I do too. Say it. I love everybody. Oh, <laughs> see? All right. Bye. Bye.